Hey, so we got uh we got Adam Sandler and Andy Sandberg. Take two. I saw Hotel Transylvania. It's um uh, it's the new Sony animation movie. It's ten, they're like third or fourth when it comes to dopeness of of, of cartoons they be, be producing. Pixar is first, DreamWorks second, and then I give it to Sony because Cloudy with a chance of meatballs and shit. Um, it's it's directed by uh you know say excuse my pronunciation uh Gindy Tartakovsky. I hope that's right. He uh he made Dexter's Laboratory and uh Powerpuff Girls some some nineties uh Cartoon Network shows. Um, like I said though, Adam Sandler he plays Dracula. Uh, let me see if I can run down all these characters, man. Um, Selena Gomez, she plays Dracula's daughter. Um, David Spade plays the Invisible Man. Kevin James is Frankenstein. Steve Buscemi is a wolf, man. Uh, John Lovitz is Quasimodo. CeeLo Green is uh, the mummy. David Spade is the Invisible Man. Repeated myself. So what? Um, is he Fran Dresser is in this joint? Um, so, it starts off, you know what I'm saying, uh, Dracula is, is reading and singing lullabies to his little baby daughter, and when she's, when she's a baby, and, like, I don't know, man, maybe, like, a little kid, she's voiced by, by Adam Sandler's actual daughter, um, the, Dracula's, Dracula's wife, or, Ex, not ex-wife, I ain't gonna say ex-wife, so that's not true at all. Um, the the girl that Dracula was married to, you know what I'm saying, his baby mom, is voiced by Adam Sandler's real, actual wife. And that's cool that he be incorporating his family in the movie. Um, and Andy Samberg, he plays the human. And I guess, like, Adam Sandler, Dracula, he made a wish to his, his wife to build a place where monsters would be welcome, away from humans. And Andy Samberg plays Jonathan, a human. He stumbles upon um, Hotel Transylvania. And, like, everybody likes him. Like, Dracula dresses him up as, as a monster to blend in. And everybody, he's the life of the party. Andy Samberg's character is the life of the party. Everybody digs him. Everybody wants to hang out with him, chill with him, except Dracula. Uh, Dracula wants to get him out of there as soon as he can, but, um, you know, you, you know, in all cartoons, and, and Dracula doesn't want, uh, humans around his people, especially his daughter. His daughter falls for the human, but they don't know it's a human, you know what I'm saying? And, um, I mean, it just takes off from there, man. Um, it's, it's a good-ass cartoon. It's one of the best cartoons of the year. Um... It's Adam Sandler's best movie since, damn near since Click. I think I said that shit on the That's My Boy review, but uh, this shit was way better than That's My Boy. Uh, Adam Sandler, he did that funny ass voice, but I mean, it fit Dracula. It wasn't annoying. Everybody everybody was funny. Kevin James was funny. David Spade was funny. Steve Buscemi. I'm surprised Chris Rock didn't, didn't play the mummy. Um... um they, they 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 take a cheap shot at Twilight, a well deserved cheap shot. Thumbs up. It was hilarious. Um in my opinion, man, Hotel Transylvania. So uh let me know two thousand twelve, your best cartoon your favorite cartoon this year, your favorite Adam Sandler movie. Um what other cartoons are coming out? Are you looking forward to Frank and Weenie? Are you looking forward to Rise of the Guardian? Um Stay tuned to my joints, like I be saying. We play Fiasco review coming, Taken Two review coming, Frank and Weenie review coming, um, Raps NBA preview. Try to get my man uh, Old Pizzle for the NBA preview about two three weeks away, and um, I'm out. <laughs>